Psst. Audio transmission incoming. Congratulations, Riftbreaker Novak. You've secured Galatia 37 for colonization. This is a huge step forward for all of humanity. Our expeditionary forces can start building up a colony. This planet has an abundance of natural resources that will enable our civilization to thrive for centuries to come. Your bravery and persistence will serve as an inspiration for future generations of Rift Breakers. The galaxy is full of planets that are waiting to be discovered and explored. Our new home on Galatea 37 will allow us to go further than we have ever gone before. The procedure has overloaded the quantum synchronization core. Ashley, the portal is destroyed. We will not be able to open the rift to Earth without that core. Why didn't you finish the procedure? Opening the portal would only lead to the destruction of this planet. The creatures that we've been fighting were only trying to protect their home. Humanity is just like these creatures. It's an apex predator trying to survive by devouring other species, constantly expanding its territory. We can't stop humanity from colonizing this planet, but we can take more time to study it, to learn how to preserve as much as we can and how to coexist. They will send someone else to complete this task. I'm counting on it. The Rift Synchronization Core is destroyed. We can't reconstruct it ourselves. We have failed our primary objective. I chose a different objective. Why would you do that? That does not make any sense. I want to build a new home for humanity on this planet, and I don't want it to be strip mined, exploited, and destroyed before there's even a chance to create a self-sustainable civilian colony. We were not tasked with building up a self-sustainable colony. Why do you assume that the planet would be destroyed? That was not the plan for Galatea 37. You've seen that final attack wave. All of these species from different parts of the planet were working together against us. If the expeditionary forces had stepped through that portal, they'd quickly label this planet as a hostile environment not suitable for human colonization. The local fauna is too aggressive and too dangerous to risk cohabitation. This is a bold assumption, and even if that were to be true, destroying the portal still does not make any sense. How do you imagine to make these creatures not try to destroy us? I don't know. But my duty as a scientist is to try to figure out how. There's too much at stake to not try. Destroying the portal only bought us some time. They will reconstruct the Rift Synchronization Core and prepare a new candidate for this mission. We can't stop humanity from claiming Galatea, but we have to try to prepare it for peaceful colonization. Ashley, your goals are my goals, and I will always follow your commands. However, please note that I think you are insane. Thank you, Mr. Riggs. Note taken. Okay, Miss Crazy Scientist. How do you want to save this world? I'm glad to have you on board, Mr. Riggs. Let's start with making our presence more friendly to the environment. I think that the first step to creating a self-sustaining economy is to switch from mining resources to cultivating them. It might be possible, but we are going to have to gather saplings from a lot of flora. Constructing such an amount of cultivators is going to be a huge undertaking. That's not all. If we want to learn how to live near these creatures, we have to study them. We need to gather research samples for all the species that we've met here. Watch your that, Ashley. This is going to be a long mission. The longest one, Mr. Riggs. The longest one. <laughs> 